Okay, here I tighten all four screws tight enough so they won't turn when I put will put block on top of it. So next step will be to put some thermal grease and I use jelly. I'm not showing how I do that. If you want to see you can check my other video when I'm showing uh, how to apply um, thermal grease on, on a CPU. So basically we'll just continue with installation for the for the block itself. There's a protection film on the surface of the block which obviously need to be removed. So you see nice and clean. Okay here. And um, some reports suggest that um, vertical orientation of those uh, inlets outlets uh, would give you better results than horizontal like this okay I tried to repeat it myself and um, I didn't really get any difference in my tests but many other people said there is a difference so I will follow general recommendation and um, of other testers and I will align inlets outlets in a vertical manner like this okay so <coughs> essentially what we will do here we lower block on the CPU wiggle it a little bit now we'll put springs and I will attach nuts on top so the last step will be put some tension on the block and it needs to be done in a, in a cross manner like this right? so I tighten a little bit here and there a little bit here and there again and I so go until you feel some resistance The more pressure you put, the basically better connection to the CPU. But again, you, you don't need to uh, overdo this. Or you can put too much pressure. So I usually go with the LT block to get like a couple millimeters sticking out. After that, I, I add a little bit more tension. And um, here where digital caliper would be a good good thing here. So if you have something like this, use it. And um, just make equal let me see, equal tension on each okay. 21 millimeter sounds good. 21 here as well Twenty one. Twenty one. okay this is actually pretty much equal but what I'd like to do it I would like to make 20 millimeters so to get a little bit more pressure Okay, so I have here 2058, 20, so 2060, get a little bit more, okay, a little bit more, yep, so here 26, a bit more, 23, a little bit less, okay, so that's what you do, and uh, 
when you get equal pressure on each post, then you're done. Okay? So you we just completed uh, this water block installation. So we need next step to put board back into the case and we can continue with the uh, piping. And that's pretty much will be very close to the end. Stay tuned.